Mmm. It's like a penis. It's not like a penis. It's cheese, guy. Yeah. You mean your vagina? No. Oh, your butt. No. You're acting. No, really. Namaste, everyone. Namaste, everyone. Apka kya hal hai? I'm learning Hindi this week. In case you didn't know. He's doing a pretty good job at it, actually, and uh, maybe in a month or so you'll be ready enough to do a video in Hindi. I doubt that, but please. Petition in the comments below if you want that to happen. But um, it was welcome back uh, and hello to all the parakas. And today we're going to be filming a video, which is having Stephen identify female or girl products. Um, you did grow up with an older sister. I did, yeah. And yeah. you've known me for a while now. <laughs> a while. I've seen many female products in my time. But I don't even use all of these. I've just gotten a bunch of general female products for you to identify. Okay. And um, you're like, actually, I don't even know what that is, but <laughs> like, I assume someone uses it. Let's see. Okay, before we start this video, you can comment below and then you can comment at the end. But how well do you think Steven's gonna perform? Right, Steven is bohot acha. Is that correct? You ready? Okay. Yeah. Here is product number one. <laughs> is it? Is it? Is it? A, it's not a liner, is it? No. No. How big is it? Can you give me like? Is it this big? No, this is not to size. Uh, it would say it's probably this big in real life. This is something that you. I think it's related to like women parts. Is that correct? No. 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 <laughs> Men can use it too. Men can use it. Yeah. Well, definitely not a period line then. Um, <laughs> not that men can't use it. Um, the coloring is so confusing. It makes like it just makes me think of blood. Um, I think it might be something that you use like for your nails, like to clean off your nails. Is that right? You're way off. No? Okay, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what it is. It. I don't know. It's a wax strip. When you... Oh, it's a wax strip? Yeah. That doesn't look like a wax strip. It does look like a wax strip. Is that what it actually looks like? Yeah. Wow. Men can use that. Yeah. Okay. Um, this is a vibrator. Yeah. Good job. Thank you. Very easy. <laughs> it also looks like a whale. It does. <laughs> a whale vibrator. A whale vibrator. It's like, mm. <laughs> Okay. What is this? <laughs> is it the thing that you use to clean your vagina? Like um, a skadoosh? A skoosh? A douche. A douche? Is it a douche? That's what a douche is. Skadoosh. Right? Skadoosh. It's like a birthing tool. So people use it to like prepare the vaginal canal. Canal. No. No? That's how I use it, but clearly I've been misusing it. <laughs> That's really embarrassing. Um, are oh, these are so hard. I have no idea. It's essentially a urination device. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. I was, I think that's why I was in the no, right direction. No, you were thinking of sticking it up the vagina. This is to make sure that the pee comes out in a particular way. But then it, ha but it has to be, oh, is this like attached over? You wear it. And, and then you, you pee, pee into that? Yeah. And then it comes out as like, so it's like less like spray all over the place. Yeah. So it's like a penis. It's not like a penis. <laughs> It's not like a penis. <laughs> that is one function of the penis. Let it be known. Okay. What is this? The tampon. Yeah. Easy. Love me some tampons. Actually, so interesting how. Oh my God. So interesting how different cultures see tampons as being totally appropriate or like really inappropriate. Yeah. I don't, I don't know where India falls on that. India falls more on the, I mean, more and more people are becoming 
uh, okay with it, but it falls more on the inappropriate. They're kind of stigmatized. Yeah. Yeah. You could not buy tampons in like Taiwan when I lived there in high school. Not that I was searching for tampons, but if I were to have been, it's very hard actually to find tampons. Yeah. It's possible, but it's not readily available. Which will use pads. Cool. Ye kya hai? Ye kya hai? Ye bottle open or hey? <laughs> Maybe a separate female model. <laughs> it does look like a bottle opener. This looks like something that you use to open your vagina. Yeah. Um, for what reason? I don't know. It looks incredibly painful. Is this for like someone looking into the vagina? Yes. Like an OBGYN? It's called a speculum. Let's go. This is not really a female product, by the way. I mean, this is a product that women use, but it's like... When are you going to stick this in a man's penis? <laughs> God, holy shit. My guess is most of your viewers have never seen this. Okay, so if you've never seen a speculum before, comment below. Yeah, or you just comment below your belief about how speculum is spelled, because I have no idea. Like, <laughs> yeah, try to spell speculum, Nathan. Or if you've never seen a speculum in your life, comment below Ladu. <sighs> this is a pad. No. This is a liner? Yes. I actually don't know the difference between a liner and a pad. Liner is like, when you're like post period, kind of? When you're spotting post period. Yeah. And this. This is a pad. It's a pad, and you notice the difference it has. More like it attachments. Where is it attached to though? The base of your underwear. You fold it down. Oh. Wait, wait, it's on the outside or the inside of the underwear? So you stick the main thing on the underwear, and then the, f the wings fold down so that it doesn't move. No, no, I know, but like. Underwear. Why would it be on the outside? I don't know your <laughs> ways. <laughs> I'm sure there's someone who's put on the outside before, okay? But that's dumb, then your underwear just gets stained. Agreed. But your underwear already gets stained. Do you stained. remember the name for underwear in Hindu? No. Chaddi. Chaddi. Uh, like a chaddi chaddu. Ladu, you it's a chaddi ladu. Chaddi ladu. Okay, wait, I have to give me this contest. Oh my god. Since <laughs> we're already talking about ladus, um, <laughs> I was explaining to Stephen what ladus are. In fact, I have a video about that on my Instagram, you can check it out. We're just talking about like what a ladu is. <laughs> So, once I explained it to him, I said it's funny, you know, like a ball-shaped object, and then I gave all these things, and he picks up his jetty and makes it a ball, and he's like, Is this a jetty ladu? A jetty ladu? <laughs> what is this? The, these are amoebas that only women have. Bacteria for women. Oh my god, <laughs> they're usually blue and green, so... I'm a Monty, and I... This one's pre-med, okay. Um, <laughs> The shape is throwing me off because it seems like nothing would ever need to be this shaped. You know, like, give me anything that should be shaped like this that's not a petal. And I think it's like makeup remover, but I don't really know. It's a makeup remover, no. No? Why would makeup remover be like this? I don't know. It's, usually, it's similar. The makeup remover is often like it's like tan circular things. No, it's not. Have you not seen me remove makeup? Sometimes they are. No, they are. No, they're or not. they're in like the. Sometimes! I well, that, that's a makeup applier, excuse me. You don't say, you don't say okay, like sure, this. Sure, sure. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. But this is not that. Um, this is a. Muche nahi pata hai. Tika patalme? 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 Patalme ka malab kya hai. Should I tell you? Huh? What are you? These are nipple stickers. Fair, but why? First of all, that's just so that you can go and see your nipples. Yeah, if you're wearing something. That I actually need these because, wow, this is so, like, my nipples are always poking. I'm gonna see. It's not that bad. What's this? This is all, like, eye stuff, right? If you put this in your eye, you would die. If this is my eye would die, you would die. Not that you're putting your eye, but like for like your um like it's like makeup, right? No. no? Is this also a vibrator? No. Um But it probably does vibrate. Are you sure it's not makeup? Yeah. Is this for like your skin? No. What other parts are there? These brushes are throwing me off. Is this like an ear cleaner? 
Like a nose cleaner? Just for women. Just for women, yeah. What is something that women have that men don't have that you use this for? Is it vaginal cleaner? No. Everything is in men to enter the vagina. <laughs> well, that's definitely true. Um, <laughs> it's not a vibrator. No. It's not makeup. It's not skincare. I have no idea. It's a nail shaper. Oh. I saw this already. This is, um, this is like what you put your feet on for pedicure. Yeah. Yeah. This is a little, a little cheating, but you wouldn't have known. I wouldn't have known. Like no, that would have taken so long. Also, like little butts. So cute. You can. Yeah. I mean, this is, this is, what is that, what is it called in a cookie? When you have like a funnel? It is, yes, funnel? It, is, okay. it is like a funnel. Um, this is like also one of those things you pee into. No. No? Oh, I know this is, this is um, for pumping out breast milk. <laughs> no? I was so confident. Really? <laughs> Do you have that here? That would be a good one. Messed up. Really? This is not for pumping out breast milk? No. How big is this? This is like massive. This big. Okay. This is vaginal really. Mm -hmm. This is like a, a cleanser. Mm -hmm. Vaginal cleanser. It uses the vagina to clean other things. No, okay, shit. How is that possible? It could like, go. how can you. Okay, whatever. What else Medicine? comes out of your vagina? Pee? And, no, pee doesn't come out of blood. your vagina. Blood. It's called blood cleanser? Yeah. Oh, is this. So it's like an inner tampon. It's called a menstrual cup, where you collect it in the cup, and you, the reason it's become more popular is because it's very, it's biodegradable and very environmentally friendly and reusable. Mm. How big? It's like this big. This big. Like this is the length. Yeah. So you just have it like hanging below, or do you no, stick you it just up? Stick it up. Ah, interesting. And then why? Why does it? What is the hole at the end? Is it dripping into something? It's collecting it. Yeah. It's it's just easier mm. for you to take it out. Imagine how are you gonna like stick it in and take something out? You need something to hold on to. Oh, interesting. Okay, cool. <laughs> Here we can do it. <laughs> this is called dimensions. Is this a like pregnancy thing that, mm -mm. that allows you to see your baby? So I don't think this is is this hair related? Is this like a spawn tool? Very expensive salon tool, so. You think most women know this? I don't think women know this one. You're showing me things that you think women know, but I don't think they know this. They do, if they're, okay, I'll give you a clue. If they're after a certain age, they know this. Is this like a polyp machine? Like looking for? Yeah. Yeah? Close, yeah. Where? Like, where? Yeah. Like in your vagina? No. Oh, your butt? No. Your rectum? No, really? <laughs> where else would you want to look for abnormalities? Your breasts. Oh, it's like a mammogram? Mm hmm Oh, uh, okay, cool. That's a mammogram, that's cool. This is a loofah. That's correct. Okay, wait, what is this? Um, this is also put in the vagina. Mm hmm But I have no idea what it is. It's like, looks like a fishing rod. Yep. Do you want to tell me what it is? Yeah. It's an ID. Oh, this is an ID. This must be very small. Though. Yeah. Oh, it's pretty this big? Yeah, it's a heavy. Small size, big power. That is true. Small size, big power. This video is brought to you by IUDs Unlimited. <laughs> when you need IUDs, we've got them. Oh, and they're gosh. not this big. Okay, let's go. <laughs> this is a heating pad for your stomach. That's true. You use it a lot when you are on your period. That is true. Good power of observation. Yep. This is a hair strainer. What? No? Yeah, it is. No. It's like a hair, like something. Yeah. Curler. It's hair curler. It's called a hair tongue. Okay. Fair enough. Is this a, like a cap you put on a hair, like a hair blower, hair dryer? Yes. But for what kind of hair? I'll give you a clue. It's to poof your hair? No, it's very likely that your mom or your sister have used this, but I'm very unlikely to use it. 
Mm-mm-mm. Oh, for white people. Oh my god. Got it. <laughs> it's not for white people. <laughs> uh, it's for like curly hair. Yeah. And hair it's diffuser. hair diffuser. What? So that's like, so it keeps it curly? Yeah. It, it helps dry it in, in, uh, in a way that maintains the curls. Mm. Okay. Is this one of those like reed slinks? Like, no. No? Oh, this is also hair curling. Yeah. Yeah. Use this to like uh, clean your eyebrows? No. Or, no? You could. I guess it's like to remove hair. Yeah, yeah, it's a face shape. It's a face razor. Yeah. Eyelashes. Why didn't you start with these? These are so easy. This is eyelash. What? Like an eyelash applier, you're like adding eyelashes. <laughs> you, you could use it this way, but it's also used to just like, ex like to take your eyelashes and curl them, make it, them look bigger. Eyelash curler, yeah. That's correct. This is clay that women often use to make bowls. No. <laughs> um, I don't know what this is. Is this like where does it go? Face mask. Where does it go? I can, how can I know? There's no scale. This looks bigger than IUD. It is bigger than an IUD, but not that much bigger. Because in your mouth. No. I mean, it's, it goes in your vagina. Yeah. There's only so many holes. <laughs> you know. It's like in your ear, but for what? It's it's called a diaphragm. It's a it's like a female condom, and you basically put it in to stick mm. it toward the cervix so that it prevents sperm from going in. Sweet. This is so like subtle. Um, oh, got it. This is a Peter Bread wrap. For women. For women. Yeah, for women. <laughs> yeah, no, I, this is um, this is a ah, ah. makeup remover. No. No. It's a bra insert. Um. I'll give you a clue, this is not inserted anyway. Not inserted? Like <laughs> this is like a roller. No. You roll your skin. Well, you do put it on your skin. You like rub your skin with it? Only your face. Like a pore remover? No. So <laughs> it's called a beauty blender. It's what you used to put. Oh, uh, this is like somewhat new, right? It's not new, but it's become more popular, popular right? yeah, in yeah. the past few years. You see me with this, I have a yellow one. Yeah, as you say so. Huh. That's that it? it? Oh my god. I'm exhausted. <laughs> I'm literally exhausted. Somewhere around the hair curl, I just started getting so tired. I was like, holy crap. You're like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. That was hard. I think that was a lot. My, my favorite one was a mammogram. Because it was like, it was this word I knew of, but, but I had no know idea what it was. Meant, I know. Yeah. Well, I didn't know what it meant, but I didn't know what it looked like. Hmm. You know? My least favorite was the speckometer. Speculum. Speculum. Which no one knows. They know what it is. Well, you have to let us know. You should comment let do below if you don't Highlight know what it is. Um, okay, well. People like having you on this channel, so we should ask them what other kinds of videos they want to see you in. We've already promised a yeah. Hindi video in the, mm. uh, in the distant, distant future. future. <laughs> Very distant. Near distant future, but uh, let us know, comment below what other kinds of videos you want to see yeah. Steven in. Yeah, that's it. Let's see. Let me, let us know. Let Avanti, Avanti is really the decision maker here, so let her know what videos I should be in. I am really just a body. A warm body. <laughs> You're, really, so. You're a warm body? Are you warm? You yeah, seen, I'm pretty warm. Seen, oh, no, 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 I'm just a body. I'm not even warm now. You see this. You see this. It's ridiculous. Jairam Jiki. Hari Om. Namaste, everyone. That's what my nanu says, but yes, that is. Hail be to Ram. Hari Om. Oh, God. Namaste. Hari Om. Okay. Bye, everyone. Bye. Mm-hmm.